Hey, Cross Park wanted to bring you some updates today, a few things to tell you about, remind you about. First, as most of you know, we are meeting every Sunday morning at 9 a.m. at Reformed Theological Seminary. If you don't know how to get there, it's 2101 Carmel Road. But also, Sunday morning, you will receive an email with information about the service, which will include directions and where to park, etc. Uh, most Sundays in the summer, we know we've had the concern that it's going to be hot. So we're meeting early in the morning and uh, directing people towards the shade and away from the sun. This Sunday, we might have the opposite problem. If you've lived in North Carolina for any period of time, this doesn't surprise you that one Sunday it's hot and the next Sunday it's cold because this is what our weather is like. So we're still going to meet at 9 a.m., but you may want to think about sitting slightly differently this week. You might want to sit in the sun, potentially. And you also might want to bring some layers. You know, just think about it like it's a fun Friday night football game and you're trying to keep from being too chilly. So uh, we're still going to meet at 9 a.m. this week and see how it goes. Our plan is to be outside as long as we can. Of course, we don't know exactly what our circumstances will look like, but we're going to meet outside this week. We may end up shifting the service a little bit later in the weeks to come if we need to, to deal with the weather, the temperature. So come join us Sunday morning. Again, if you haven't been able to join us yet for whatever reason, you're welcome to continue to watch the digital service but we'd love to invite you to come on out to the parking lot if you haven't had a chance to check it out yet. It's been very encouraging uh, to be with God's people, to be encouraged, to be motivated for what God has for us and to do it together with the body. And even though it's outside and in a parking lot, that sounds sort of like not church, but it isn't at all. It's God's people gathered together to worship, to hear the word, uh, even to celebrate communion, which we'll do in two weeks. So come join us. We are trying to make these services um, as normal feeling as they can. We're going to continue this series that we've been in. Uh, it's our Fall Vision and Value series on um, unchanging realities in a changing world. So what are the anchors for us in the storm that we're all experiencing? So come join us this week. Jordan's preaching on the fact we talked last week that God hasn't changed. This week we're going to talk about how the go, the mission, the call, to be the church and proclaim good news in our world, that hasn't changed. So join us this Sunday. Also, there are going to be other opportunities for you this fall. You've heard me talk about them. Discipleship groups and smaller groups. And in this email where you clicked on this video, there are the links to sign up. So we'd love to hear from you by the end of the month, by the end of September, so we can get people into those weekly men's and women's discipleship groups. Uh, sign up for that. Or monthly smaller groups, groups of four to eight people, meeting on a back porch for dinner, fellowship, and prayer. Again, if you're in a small group, check with your small group first, uh, because most small groups are going to be facilitating these smaller groups. But if you're not in a small group, or if your small group isn't going to be able to turn into smaller groups, then fill out the form, and we will gladly connect you with other people. Uh, it's a weird fall, as we all know, and yet God's at work. And so come join us in for any of these ministry opportunities, so we can continue together to listen to God, to see how he's showing his grace to us, and to discern how he wants to pass on his grace through us. Well, Cross Park, thanks for listening to this update. Click on the links in the email, sign up for what you need to, and we look forward to seeing you really soon. Take care.